I was looking for a place that in maybe 10 or so years would be really good because I wouldn't be as healthy or I would have needs that I don't have now. And this was perfect. We had formerly lived in the Upper Valley and we needed to change our life and slow it down a bit. And here we are and we're as happy as we can be. I'm the outdoorsy one, and I'm um, so happy to have the ability to hike wherever I want to hike, bike wherever I want to bike. In the winter time, I love to snowshoe, cross-country ski, and just enjoy the snow. My husband enjoys meeting people, and he has found many, many different outlets for his need for socialization. I've always been a gardener, and it has been a lovely experience for me to garden here this year. I have my own raised bed right outside my door, and I have mostly flowers, but some kale and fennel, so I can just go out and snip a little for a salad. I also enjoy the apple orchards and it's very nice to sit in the new gazebo and look around, which is lovely for me. You get an array of entrees, appetizers, all kinds of veggies, salads, and too many desserts, <laughs> which we can't resist usually. <laughs> What brought me here was the friendliness. I have my own private apartment. People respect your privacy, but at the same time, they try to involve you in things. What's most important about being in an independent living facility is having a personal connection with everyone around you, so you don't feel like you've really left home. 